the five things you should not do during allergy season. Hey everyone, it's Dr. Q working at ENT and Allergy Associates. Let's go through the things you should not be doing if you have springtime allergies. Number one, not checking pollen counts when you go outside. Remember, there's high pollen count days and low pollen count days. There's several websites that you can go to see exactly what the pollen count is. www.pollen.com is a great resource. You check the pollen counts. If it's high, you know that you have to start doing all the things for your allergies. Keeping your windows and your doors closed at home. Keeping the windows closed when you're driving. Coming home at night, taking a shower, changing your clothes because you do not want to sleep with all the pollen on you. Number two, forgetting your sunglasses. If you get allergic conjunctivitis, you'll notice itchy, red, watery eyes. Having sunglasses as a protective barrier will really help protect your eyes so that you don't get a lot of these symptoms. The other, number three, would be mowing the lawn, raking leaves, doing gardening. Doing these activities will stir up the pollen, cause it to go up in the air and irritate you further. So in general, we recommend to not do these things, see if you can convince someone else to do it. But if you do have to do these things, these activities, you should just wear a mask because that'll protect your uh, nasal passages further. Number four, waiting too long to start your allergy medications. If you started having your allergy symptoms, such as a tickle in the throat, itchy watery eyes, sneezing, runny nose, that means your allergy is starting to kick in. Starting your pills, nose sprays, eye drops early will help fix your allergies much faster. If you wait, it can take a lot stronger medication to start working. Remember, nose sprays can take two to three weeks to really start working and fix the congestion. Spring is tree pollen, summer is grass, fall is weed pollen. If you know when your season is, taking the nose sprays two to three weeks before the season starts can help significantly for your allergies. Last thing, number five, that you do not want to do during allergy season is ignoring signs of infection. So oftentimes we have allergies and they get worse and they go into your sinuses causing fever sinus pain, discolored mucus, yellow-green mucus, or you're just not getting better with the medications. That means this may have progressed to a sinus infection. You do not want to wait to go see a doctor. You should come in and be evaluated. The other thing to think about is not every symptom you have during spring is an allergy. It could just be a COVID infection, that's still happening, or some other type of infection. So if you're not sure exactly what's going on, come in, see a doctor, and be evaluated for whatever it is. If you're not sure what you're allergic to, come in, get tested. It's very easy, it takes 15 to 20 minutes, it's a skin test, and you get a full list of everything you're allergic to, what times in the year you're gonna have more symptoms, and what to avoid.